Hi guys, this is Boris from bikedriven.com and I'm back with another short video and today I will be looking at Raven CR rechargeable front light. Doesn't matter what kind of cycling you do, all of us need lights, especially in low light conditions in order to see the road, in order to be, to be visible, etc. This is an essential piece of cycling accessories. And this particular light I have been using for quite some time and there are some features that I really like about them and I can't wait to tell you about it. Uh, so one thing that, that I wanted to start with, and that's of course very subjective, but I like just, just the way this light, light looks. Um, I find the design to be very slick, to be very simple, and in, it just very durable and high quality. Like if, if you touch it, you, you can feel that it's, it's very good quality. It's not the type of light that is easy to break. You know, if it falls, it's done. Um, and the look in general is, is quite cool. The other thing that I really like is that it has a very high rating of water resistance. And all of us have to ride in rainy conditions at some point of time. And, you know, you, you wouldn't really want to be worried about your light anytime you get under some rain. And this, right, this light can withstand, you know, showers and rain, which, is, which I find to be crucial and very important because I don't want to buy a different set of light lights anytime I get under some rain. Um, also it comes with a very cool feature that I think it's it's quite amazing um, and I'll use some of the some of the extra features that I have here to, to, to visualize this. So it comes with a wired remote button and what it means is that if you plug this button into the light and let's say you attach it to your handlebar next to your thumb you can actually use the button to change the light modes on the go and you don't have to stop and you know change the buttons change the the mode manually or like try to press this button on the go and as the light can move up and down um, i found this to be very cool actually and the way it works is that first you have to turn on the light um, so you cannot turn it on with the button the button is only to change the modes and anytime you press it as you can see the modes are changing um, with the press and, with the press of the button, uh, which uh, you know I found it to be to be super cool. It's not very hard to attach. It doesn't take a lot of extra space, and uh, it's it's super nice. Um, yeah, the other thing that that I wanted uh, that I wanted to show you is um, that uh, you you get a lot of some small and very nice features. For example, the um, automatic light memory uh, light memory mode. Uh, so whenever you turn on the light, it will use the mode that you previously used before you turned it off. So it actually will remember the mode that you used before and it will start with the same one, uh, which is quite useful, you know, if you like a particular mode and uh, you use it most of the time, anytime you turn on the light, you don't have to click the button a couple of times to find whatever you need, it will just be back with, um, with where you finished off. Um, which, I, you know, it's, it's quite nice. Also, it has like a low battery life indicator sort of signal so anytime the the battery life is low it will it will flash here um, uh, with red uh, color so you will know that it's it's time for charging um, in terms of downsides um, a couple of things here one is definitely the the price it's not the cheapest light out there obviously you pay for the quality but it's around like 50 55 um, dollars, um, which you know many of us would not be be willing to spend this much, and totally fine with me. Uh, however, you know it's it's good quality. It's very durable. It's water resistant. It has many features that you will definitely appreciate. Many light modes. Um, so the price, depending you know depending on how much you want to spend, but it could be a negative factor for sure. Also, one tiny thing is that. Um, if you use it on the highest or the brightest mode, the battery life will last, you know, like 1.6 hours, and um, which is probably not not a lot. So you won't be using it that much on the highest highest mode. But anytime you switch to a lower mode, which is 250 lumens, the battery life um, is actually three hours, which is which is quite quite okay if you ask me. Um, so overall, very, very good quality light with a lot of, you know, cool features. This is how you attach it uh, to your handlebar. Um, you don't need any extra screws or any tools to do it. It's very quick and very easy. 
and in general the type of light i would definitely recommend and um, if you are looking for inspiration you know what kind of light to get i actually wrote a couple of articles on bikedriven.com about best rear bike light bike lights about best front bike lights for commuting for mountain biking etc i will link those in the descriptions below uh, so you can take a look and you know use it for additional inspiration and thanks so much for staying with me this long in the video i hope you found it useful and if you have any questions let me know in the comments below or if there is a particular product that you would like me to review let me know in the comments as well i'll try to buy the product and actually provide my honest review so thanks again for staying with me this long have a wonderful rest of the day uh, bye bye